Hey babes, welcome to or welcome back to my channel. If you are new, welcome and if you subscribe, thank you so much for being here. And of course, thank you for always supporting my channel. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and of course, subscribe to the channel. I would love to go ahead and have you here. Today's video is going to consist of my updated stash. It is significantly smaller than what I have because I have used up countless and i mean countless amount of products and i don't want to say i'm over the product junkieism but i am because y'all i have things in here from last year's black friday sale that's 365 days ago and it has still not been used. I just have too much products. I can only wash my hair so often. So I'm kind of over it. So I'm very happy that my stash has decreased the way that it has. But nonetheless, I am going to just put up here my last stash video. It was all four of my bookshelves completely full to the brim with products even my two baskets that i have under and now we down to two so let's go ahead and see what i still have in my stash what products i'm going to discover that i haven't used <laughs> all right y'all we're going to start off with this first section up here i do have sultanicals over here i have a can't believe it's not Butter Afrotastic Curl Elastic. Ooh, you see? This is one of my faves. Then I have a Shebe Butter Shampoo down there. I have this rice water, which I was very into. I feel like everyone was. I just... Not so much. Mm -hmm. This. This is bomb. I don't even know why I'm not using it, but this Slip and Slide... It's made with okra, and if you need to detangle your hair, this is it. Next up, we do have Briogeo. This is their, this right here. This Scalp Revival Charcoal Shampoo is the truth. See this? It's from last year. Still there. Haven't used it. A leave-in. This is the Scalp Revival Just Mask. Back here, I have my treasured. Okay, very treasured clay mask by Chocolate Kings and Curls. This one is the Coco Creme. And then the one at the bottom is the Terry Black. Can you please focus? The Terry Black Clay Wash. Baby, I use those on special occasions, okay? Because she ain't making them no more. Even though I did see her post, but yeah. They're treasured for me. I have my Ceremonia which I absolutely love, the guava leave-in, the papaya salt scrub, then I have the mask and the gel, of course. Back here, I do have Main Crush, and you see, this is part of last year as well, and I was so, so excited to purchase it and use it, and they're just sitting here. I have this clay wash, the Crisis Control Unicorn Curls and the Ayurvedic Pre Poo. I really like that Pre Poo. <laughs> I used to be a Pre Poo stand. Not that I'm not. I just don't. I, I, I don't be wanting to work a lot. <laughs> but then I do have this Derma E. Get it? It's just bomb. I do have Ajua Beauty back here. This is also from last year's Black Friday sale. I have the Curl Defining Cream. I have the Curl Defining Gel. And then I have the Bowman Blue Tansy Repair Mask. My hair actually needs some protein. I may just use that. And then the last product that I do have is the leave-in which smells 
so good and works so good. Y'all should already know I love Carol Smith. Carol Smith is just chef's kiss. If you guys remember this, I picked this up at, is it TJ Maxx or Marshall? TJ Maxx for half of the price. Go there and check out their products because half a price, yes ma'am. Okay, and that's just a fragrance-free jelly. Then I do have the Super Slip Prebionic Primer. This is a three-step system. Just to clarify your hair, this is the Post Calming Conditioning Conditioner. I have the Weightless Air Cream. And then I do have the Wash and Scrub Prebiotic. Let me just put this back. <laughs> then I do have this full body thickening lotion. This was another pickup at TJ Maxx as well. I will be completely honest and say I don't, I don't, I don't, I need to try it again. I could, I, I don't, it's not a necessity. Okay, that, 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 that's what I'm trying to get at. It's not a necessity. This curl conditioning oil and cream, absolutely the best. I used this when I was transitioning. This is so, so good. I got it in the jumbo size because they do have one in the tin. And then back here, I do have the Hydro Flexi Jelly, which is a very flexible hold gel. Works super good. Next up, as I talk and put things back, I do have the K18 system, which I recently reviewed. If you haven't watched that video, please go ahead and watch it. Then I do have the Day ma'am i'm back i do have the day styling cream i still haven't used it but i promise y'all i'm going to get to it then up next i do have the mesh boost hydrating leave-in this is a lightweight just leave-in it's not my favorite i have another one actually talking about that i have the original leave-in i'll just pop up in a picture in here i have it in the bathroom but this is not my favorite one so it's just okay to me then i do have the indulge moisturizing deep conditioner bomb the sculpt curl defining gel bomb you have to use a lot of water with this please apply it in soaking wet hair if not you will be transported to alaska and you will have a village of snow on you then we do have the Sweet Pumpkin Spice Mask. I need to try that. Uh, I need to try that, actually. See? That, that's another thing, okay? Then we have the Warm Sugar Cookie Mask. The, these are things that I should be rotating because it's, it's that type of weather. You see, this is what I'm saying. The, these are products that I just have sitting here. But that's all that I have for this first row quite a lot of products it is honestly packed all the way to the back as you guys can see so it is still a lot of products but compared to what i had yeah then this second show that i do have i'm gonna start from the back as well i have the Eden Body Works again. This is from last year. This is the anti breakage deep conditioner, and this is a hair and body butter. I'll be completely honest. I I, I don't see myself using this. I don't. So I need to decide what I'm going to do with it. Just not right now. Then we do have. <laughs> by curls this blueberry bliss twist and shout cream i still haven't used it this is from last year's sale as well and then the blueberry bliss reparative hair mask there are curly girls who swear by this i am not one of those it is okay for me next up we do have tgin this is the curl food daily moisturizer haven't used it from last year miracle repair deep hydrating hair mask um, 
rose water hair hydrating mask still haven't used it still sitting there don't know what i'm going to use it next we have the miracle repair protective leave-in conditioner still brand new okay next we have tradux this is another product that i need to be using this smells like cinnamon cloves it smells like christmas in a bottle it just smells amazing this is their leave-in it smells so good i have the high definition which is the gel so good and the four in one hydrating cream which is just bomb to say the least then on this small section over here i do have curls and potion this is the shebe and cleansing wash <laughs> still haven't used it I have not tonic. This is a detangling, moisturizing leave-in. Yeah, I haven't used that. Um, I have this curling jelly right, right over here. Excuse me. I, I even did though. I have this curling jelly and this sweet pea mask. Yeah, I don't I don't know why I don't know why I bought all these products and they're just sitting there This is my problem now. This is my problem. So I just want to use all of them I have this one product left by pattern. This is their styling cream, which is my favorite Out of all the products if I'm completely honest. I do have this matcha green tea Mask by nature's little secret this is another brand that I use while transitioning. This brand is absolutely good. So good, actually. It's affordable and their products work very well. This specific product right here, Chef's Kiss. We do have the sculpting gel. This is the normal one, <laughs> which is the number three hold, which is my favorite. Then we have Gorilla Glue over here. <laughs> Which is the hard hold. Number five. Y'all please. If you want your hair not to move. Like not to go anywhere. Get this. Okay. This you got a flexible hold. Her. Her. Girl is good for the hair. Okay. Next we do have this cleansing oil. I really like this just because it does have that nozzle. And it goes straight into your scalp. Baby you go have a we eat clean scalp. This is my all-time favorite mousse. Chef's kiss. I use mousses more for the summer, not the winter. I need the hydration for the winter, but fave. I do have the curly magic curl stimulator by Uncle Funky's daughter. This is Chef's Kiss. This is another product that you have to apply on soaking wet hair. Otherwise, don't you you gonna regret it and you're gonna have to wash your hair again. Don't say I never told you. The next thing that I have is by Botanica. This is the only product that I have left that I just continue to purchase because it is the best. This is the mender. This is their protein treatment. This is the best protein treatment thus far that I've tried for my hair. And I always continue to go ahead and use it and purchase it. And I actually need to remember to put it in my hair. I forgot this one. Y'all, this, let, I'm gonna tell y'all something about this. This is by Not Your Mother's. This is the treatment oil. It smells amazing. I've had this bottle. I want to say for the past three years, I don't know what is in here. Who keeps refilling this? But this oil does not end. It doesn't finish. And I kid you guys not. Whenever I am breaking a gel cast or I just want some extra shine, this is the oil that I'm using. But it does not finish. Th there's a little bit in here. Y'all, this is going to stretch. Watch until 2025. Because I've had it for this long and it just does not finish. So, get it. It's affordable. It smells good. And you're going to have it for a very long time. 
I don't know what's in there. I'll tell you that though. <laughs> now, this Solon product that I have from Shea Moisture. This is their Manuka Honey Yogurt Protein Power Treatment. This smells so good. So good, y'all. It is so thick as well. This will last you a very, very long time. And it gives you the perfect amount of protein for your hair just to hold you over until you do a protein treatment or get you this, okay? Get you this. I haven't opened this up and I've had it for quite some time. Look, you see all that dust? Yeah. Like I said, I've had this for a very long time just sitting here, but y'all, if you want a good affordable protein treatment, this is it. Now, I do have this fruit plumping fine hair watermelon mask. It smells really good. It's very fine. Y'all, this is a stain I can't get out. It's not dirty, okay? It's not dirty. I cleaned this. It just won't come off. I don't know what it is. But I, I, I just don't reach for this. I'll be completely honest. I don't reach for it. I like the results. It's affordable. It smells really good. It did good in my hair. But I just don't reach for this at all. So this is another product that I just need to find out what I'm going to do with it. And then back here, I just have the remaining of my sash of nature's little secret. There is the coconut milk strengthening deep conditioner. This is the Irish moss styling cream. And then I do have the fenugreek detangling pre-poo, which is absolutely insanely good. Again, I, if I just don't have to, I'm not going to... So I just haven't been pre-pooing, but you should pre-poo. It's really good. <laughs> don't do as I say, okay? The, wait, 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 wait. What's that saying? Don't do as I do. Okay, forget. Scratch it. Scratch, scratch. Okay, j just be better than me, okay? Pre-poo your hair. Pre-poo your hair. Maybe I'll start doing it too, but that's all that I have. This is my second shelf. This is my first one. Again, I will be including the video of my stash but y'all these are all the products that i have and even just here there is so much but let me know down below what you want to see me review what products have you used in here any favorite products what did you pick up if you did pick up anything with the sales and also give me some suggestions on what i should do with these products that i really don't gravitates to I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do with them. But yeah, let me know down below and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye. <laughs>